not gonna use that knife. Actually, yeah, we don't use that knife. Yay! Ah! I'm at! Yes! Alright, let's put the box down. Oh no. Wait, is this? Are these my clothes or what the Okay, yeah, yeah, it's my clothes. What is this? Oh, that's the jewelry. We're good, we're good. All right, so drone out of the way. We're gonna put this over here. So this unboxing, it won't make too much sense unless you've seen that last video. Quick rundown, I went on a website. They had a crazy Black Friday sale. It actually is still going on from Black Friday. I believe it's gonna go on until Boxing Day. I got five items. Is that the ring? That's the ring. So for the jewelry, I got two pieces. Like I said, I got a ring. I got something else pretty crazy, but we'll get to that when we get to that. Oh, man. <gasps> that is way nicer than I expected. Bruh, 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 bruh. Please fit, it fits. Ho, 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 ho. Yo, yo, I'm amped. I'm amped. It fits on both fingers. All right, I don't know which camera I trust more. The autofocus on this one's better, so let's try this one. Focus that. I don't know if you can see it there, but Margiela's logo is like a 10, 11, 12, 13, and then I believe it's the 10. I can't really see it right now because I'm just showing it to you guys, but I believe it's the 10 or the 11 that's circled, and that's just their logo. I haven't really looked it up to see what that means. Oh yeah, it goes from 10 to 16. I usually like to read up on these designers before I buy their stuff. That is like the one that I don't know anything about. Everything else I know about the designer. I I don't know, it just makes me feel good about wearing it. Like, I know what I'm wearing, you know, I know a little history. It's not necessary, but when you meet the right people and you have the right conversations, it's just some good knowledge to have. So I'm gonna be putting this on my index finger. Pretty symmetrical situation right here. It looks kinda similar. Well, I don't wanna say it looks similar to a Cartier. Let's not do that. Let, let's not even try to do that at all. I'm not even gonna disrespect them like that. I'm sorry, but this is beautiful. I'm, I'm so happy with this purchase. All right, moving on. Before I open this, all right, this is also Alexander McQueen. There's no way that I'll find a way to wear this even once a month. This is just for those crazy special occasions aka my birthday is coming up in like a week and I want to be talking all my shit I'm not gonna be wearing this on a daily weekly even monthly basis the Alexander McQueen necklace and it's a necklace okay it's not a chain it's just an accessory it's shinier than I thought it was oh my god oh my god I'm amped I'm amped oh oh Woo! that's a beauty I wasn't ready for it to be this nice oh no 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 yeah <laughs> Let's go. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, let me take it off. I love the links. Oh my gosh. Oh man, this is nice. This is nice. All right, so one of the reasons I loved this when I saw it was that I saw the skulls in the necklace. I don't know if you can see right there, but that's actually in the shape of a skull, all of them. And so there's four of them like that linking together and that's McQueen's thing and I love it. And I just want as many skull type jewelry from McQueen as possible. So now I have the ring there, double skull with the skull necklace. And I talked about this bracelet in my last video. I have this Alexander McQueen bracelet as well with the skulls. I don't know if you guys can see that. I love it, but it doesn't really fit. It doesn't stay on. It just kind of gets really big and then falls off your wrist. That's another dope bracelet I have. All right, so we're gonna, <laughs> I'm at. Again, I'm not gonna be able to wear this very often just cause like it's a necklace. You know, when am I gonna really wear a necklace? I'll wear this maybe once every couple months. Come on, man, we don't even pop tag. We let the tag hang. We don't do full gold, we do gold plated, G. You got silver underneath, dog. Still from Italy though. Okay, I'm actually gonna keep this on just for the vid. Let's move on. We've taken way too long already and I have a new bag all right I had to change the lighting up so I hope that's not distracting but I had to bring the light into a different area because yo this is so bad man why is it four o'clock and it's pitch black outside oh this is the hat and they gave your boy a dust bag as well is that what these are called are these called dust bags I'm aged Oh man, oh man. When I saw this on the website, I was kind of scared because it kind of looked a little shiny or something, but it just came through and it's just a regular dad hat. It doesn't have the shiny stuff, so I'm so amped. All right, we're gonna fix this up. Okay, you see it, we're gonna obviously need to form fit this. It just came super squished up. It's been traveling for miles and miles. We're gonna form fit this to my head, you know, get the brim right. It's gonna take a few days, but once we get this going, oh, that's it. So that's the black Balenciaga campaign logo cap. Campaign logo because this is like the electoral campaign kind of vibes. It even might say the year, does it? Yeah, 2017. Already, this is a crazy outfit. Like, I'm already so stoked. And I like that it kind of looks bummy. All right, what's next? Now we got some clothing. Okay, I'm not gonna try this stuff on. I'm just gonna show you guys. So we got two pieces of off-white, bringing my off-white collection now to four. I think that's it. I think that's my limit. I think four, I'm done with off-white now. And I'm happy because I don't think any of 
the off-white I have is like the standard classic off-white that everybody rocks. This one though, if you don't like this tee, I don't know man, there's something wrong with you. So here we got the off-white woman tee. On the front, it has the seeing things at the bottom, starring some random names. Maybe they're not random, but it's kind of like a movie vibe. It has the rated R, and then when you turn it around, it has like the credits, like a movie. Same thing, seeing things at the bottom, and woman up top across the shoulders. I really like that touch, I'm not gonna lie. I really like the woman across the top. And oh wow, it actually, okay, one thing about Off-White, the hoodies, amazing quality. Like they're so thick, and I never had a t-shirt from Off yet. So I was kind of curious about how the quality was gonna be for the tees, but it feels like it's pretty good. I'm gonna try it on later. Wow, there's like double, triple enforcing around the collar. This is really nice. All right, we're gonna put that away for now. Your boy picked up the Nebraska hoodie. Also guys, if you haven't seen the video that I dropped where I was shopping for these things, you might think I'm kind of crazy right now. If you're coming to this video without context, you don't understand what's really going on here. Your boy got all of this completely on sale. All right, so it has Nebraska across the front. Very vibrant red outlined in black and then white, which is a detail I didn't notice when I was on the site. The drawstrings are nice and thick. And then the, what are these? I don't know what these are called. I really don't. I forget what they're called. I don't know what's going on. Egg, egg, egglet? Egglet? Is that it? I learned that from Sneaker Talk because he was talking about his shoelaces and I think it's the same thing. I might be wrong. Anyways, the egglets on these are crazy cool. No, 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 no. On the, I, I'm, there's no way that I'm going to be able to put this close enough to the camera, but on the outside tip of it, it says off white and in quotations, it says metal tip. So on the back of the hoodie, we got the white in black writing. Very ironic. All the way across the shoulder tops. Oh, I totally forgot Bong was supposed to be coming over. Oh shit. Oh shit. The cuffing on the waistband is so nice and so sturdy. It's crazy. And it's the exact same cuffing on the sleeves. Like no jogging pants, no sweater I've ever owned has had this kind of cuffing. All right. Okay, we're going to try and do this spark pretty fast. Just because like I said, Bongo's on his way. So you open up the box. First of all, let me just explain how small this is. My biggest issue with flying drones is that taking the actual drone around with you is so difficult. All right, so in this bag, uh, uh, in this bag, they gave me a shoulder bag. Okay, okay. Is it DJI branded? Okay, you see the DJI. So that's the camera bag. I can just see this tag hanging in my shadow right now. And it looks like an earring, yo. This might be a new wave. Okay, so let's do the bag first. We're gonna open it up. It is very crisp. This is nice and compact. Woo, open that up. Oh, is that bongo? All right, so you pull these out. What are these? I don't know what these are. They look like propellers, but these are not the propellers that are on the drone right now. So maybe these are other kind of propellers. If you guys can see those right there. So that's the inside of the carrying case right there. Oh, what is this? Is that the controller? Ooh, ooh, wow, that's a vibe. You see the controller? See, this is the kind of thing that would really make you feel like you're playing a little game while you're flying this. All right, so the antennas flip out. Oh no, I turned it on by accident. What else comes in the bag? What looks like a charging cord. Yeah, that's a, definitely a charging cable. One of these is probably to charge the battery and one of them is probably to charge, or no, this sticks into that and then you charge the battery. Okay, cool. This is another one of these bags with a bunch of different compartments. Yeah, oh, oh, this definitely goes into the computer and then we got a little uh Oh, that's dope. So again, I haven't used it yet or anything, so I'm kind of guessing on what things are, but this looks like it's like a charging pad for three different batteries. And there's even two USB slots in this. What's going on? Can I charge my phone in this while I'm charging my batteries? Yo, what's going on? This is really cool. So this means if you're about to go on a trek and you want to bring your drone, you can charge up all your batteries at once. My other drone does not have that option. Genius. And it's so small. That's cool, man. You got some manuals and stuff. Okay, okay, okay. So this is the case that the drone comes in. It's super small. Here we go. Boom. That's it. That's the spark right there. Ah, that's so small. That is tiny. No doubt in my mind could this fit in a pocket. How could you go somewhere and not bring this with you? You know your boy got the baby blue joint. Alright, so that's it for the unboxings. I need you guys to stay tuned though. And Bongo's gonna be here in five minutes, so I'm gonna see you guys in a bit, alright? Alright guys, here we are. You hear that echo? Yeah, oh, bro, that's a heavy Jesus. echo. We're about to test out this DJI Spark real quick. Four, three, two, one. Let's get it! Uh, 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 uh. With the Spark, there's a new feature called Gesture. Basically, what it does, it turns you into a magician. Let's check it out. Yeah. Working? Yeah. Oh! Alive? It's falling. Oh like you're... All right, so yeah. we're going to wave. Oh! 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 That's a vibe! Okay, we're going to go. We're going to turn this way. Oh, it's going. We're going to turn left. Oh, this is... This is trippy. Is you just go to manual controls, you wave, and I'll fly it away. Oh, oh, check it out. Check What's it doing? It out. 
Oh is it low battery maybe? Yeah, it's low battery. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> yo, 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 Phoenix. It was about to bury itself in the snow. Yo, it was actually about to fall in the snow. Your boy had to catch it. Oh, low battery. All right, guys, we're going to get a new battery and hit you guys up again, all right? You know when you go outside and it's so cold, you can instantly feel your boogers freezing? Yeah. Here we have a wild millennial trying to communicate with a drone. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Oh, there yeah. we go. There we go. Push it back. No, no, not land. Nope. As oh. if that landed perfectly on the smallest yeah, leg place shoot, ever. Shoot. Oh. Come over here. Come over here. Oh. All right. Come over here. Alright. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> no, it's landing again. It's landing, it's gonna fall. No, it's landing again. It's landing, it's gonna fall. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Bro, 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 bro. It's deep. It's all. It's all. It's all. <laughs> it's all. <laughs> Get the rice! Get the rice. <laughs> oh, one sec, the lens fogged up. Alright guys, so we had to come inside. Outside, there's just too many things we were fighting. The elements. We're gonna try this feature where you can actually take a picture with the drone with your hand. Alright, so we're gonna lift it up a little bit. Lift it up, there you go. I feel like Magneto. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The force is strong. The force is strong. So apparently, you just put your fingers like this. And it's gonna... Uh, I think you do it and then you like put your hands down and then back Oh! Up. Yeah, what the heck? What the Alright, we're gonna try this feature called the quick shot. So apparently if I press this button, this camera is just gonna circle me. Kinda scared. <laughs> Let's hope these sensors are bumping. Cannot enter this mode due to aircraft recording a video. You can't record and do it. Okay, boom, well, boom. I stopped looking. We can just open the garage. All right, here we go. Oh my god, I'm shook. It okay. literally says use this feature in an open area. Oh my god, I'm stressed. Okay, I'm ready to press X. Oh, don't move. Oh, 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 it stopped. It stopped. It stopped because of that. But it actually was doing it. Oh, it's landing because it's dying. But okay. All right guys, so the battery was actually dying just now. So we're gonna try it again one more time and I'm pretty sure this is gonna be the one. Here we go! Alright, we're gonna try the camera function real quick. Try this again. Here we go. Oh, the red light's flashing. <laughs> it might have low key taken it. I think it did. It might have low key taken it. Oh! Yeah! Hey, that's lit! <laughs> that's lit! That's dope. Yo, this thing is a vibe, man. That was the DJI Spark. I'm so excited to continue to use this drone. Because of its size, I'm gonna be using this like probably way more often than I should. You guys are about to see drone footage and like challenges, gaming videos. I'm droning everything. I do have to give a huge shout out to DJI though because they sent me this drone and because of them, the standard quality of my channel is about to skyrocket. If you guys end up going out and getting yourself the DJI Spark, if you're under the age of 15, try to get like a parent or an older sibling to help you fly the drone. Otherwise, you're good. Go off. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up. I don't even know if I explained this, but I'm actually in Ottawa right now. It's been a hectic few days, but the holidays have finished and I'm ready to sit down with the boys and just grind for the next few days. I still have like a week here, so you know we're about to go off. Get ready to see a few videos with the boys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and until next time, guys, don't sleep, fam. Bye.